Hey guys, how you all doing? My name is Andrew. Welcome back to episode 4 of the Q&A. Without wasting any more time, let's go. So if you guys have any questions for me, please leave them in a comment down below so that I can get as many of your guys' questions out as possible. Because obviously at the moment, as you guys know, I am creating my own questions, which is absolutely fine, but at the same time, it's not ideal. I'd love to be answering the community's questions, so please feel free to leave those comments down below. And also tweet them to me on Twitter, at FreakyKillers. There will be a link to my Twitter in the description. So yes, I am deciding to start putting in some upgrades to the editing. Now these are going to be small to start with, sort of a few music changes and a few scene changes, a few different ways that we record the videos, etc. But then eventually I will be making an upgrade on the actual editing software itself. When that change comes, I will be sure to let you know, but for now I am still using Want to Share Filmora. What camera do I have? I use a Canon 750D with the Rode mic on top. I'm pretty sure I've told you guys this before but I wanted to cover it just so you were fully aware of the fact that I cannot actually pull full HD at 60fps on this camera which is kind of irritating if I'd known at the time of purchasing I would have spent more money and gone for something a little bit higher that could in theory have done the full HD at 60 FPS but at the time I didn't really know but this is an absolute awesome camera and I would be lost without it so I have the Canon 750D. What is my job? I've told you guys this so many times before but I want to go over it in a little bit more detail because I've never really spoken properly about it so yes I work for Screwfix and they are a company which are big in the UK and they I think branch out to a few other countries I'm not too sure but I work on the side where the plumbers and electricians go and so with this I serve the plumbers and electricians I still serve other customers as well but mainly plumbers and electricians I sort all of their products for them, I see some fantastic products and I've also bought a few myself for a little project which I'm going to call Project Shed which will be coming in the summer but yeah I work for Screwfix, I work on the screw, f I work on the, sorry, the plumbing and electric side and I really enjoy my job. It's sort of a love-hate relationship from TK Maxx because I loved my job over there a lot and that's what I really wanted to do full time but at the moment where I am I'm happy and it was a good transition for me. What's my YouTube goal? Well, there are several goals. I'd love to be big one day, that's obvious, but I think everyone does. But for now, I really enjoy making videos and I really enjoy seeing the kick that comes out of it. So, for me at the moment, I want to get to 200 subs. That is a big thing for me, and then it'll be 3, 4, and 500, and then 1,000, and we'll sort of work on that eventually as well. I'd like to get to 6k views on the channel as well, that would be insane, I oh, will make a video about that when I get there, and then 10k views and 20 and 50 and 100,000, that would be awesome, but for now at least I'm going to work on getting to 6,000 views on my channel and getting to 200 subscribers on my channel. And finally, plans for the new channel, yes I have all the plans now set up, and I am deciding that I'm going to upload there and on this channel as well. So I'll still do the weekly Q&A on this channel, letting you guys know how my life is going. And I will also now be uploading on another channel. For those of you who don't know, yes, off of Impulse the other night, I have decided I'm going to set up a separate channel away from this particular audience, grab a new audience, get some new ideas going over there. And I'm going to upload sort of every day to every other day over there. I've got all the video ideas on the internet, I just need to put them into a document and start documenting this new channel. I've created all the banners and the artwork, it's all up on the channel, I'm not going to tell you guys, saw on Twitter as well. I have no recognition to tell you at the moment what the Twitter is, what the underscore username is, and I'm not going to tell you what the channel name is because I'm still changing it by the day. But for now at least, I like the design that's on there, I need to work on the banner a bit, the logo I am absolutely 100% in love with. I need to work on the banner a little bit though because that's not quite set up just yet 
but I'll get around to that eventually and when I've done it finally I will release it to you guys in a pretty separate video which will be something I'm looking forward to making. Well thank you for watching that's going to round off today's q and I really do hope you have enjoyed. Please like and subscribe if you are new and finally be confident, be creative and be smart. <laughs>